All right, hello everybody, and welcome to another episode of Musical Crafting with Mr. Myers. Uh, today, we're gonna be doing an instrument playing face mask. Okay, everybody, we are gonna cut a 14 by seven inch rectangle um, to kind of begin making this mask here. You'll see I have my sample just kind of laid here to show you roughly where I just use the bottom of a t-shirt. Um, so it's got the, the hem on the bottom of the shirt here. And so I'm just gonna cut up and do about a seven by 14 inch square. Then I'm gonna fold it in half and I'm gonna cut the diagonals about from about three inches up on either side. So I mark the center, go up about three inches, I cut the diagonal that way, I cut the diagonal this way, and that gives you that home plate shape. Step three is I'm gonna reinforce the sides with duct tape. Um, so the one side is already closed because it's the, the side of the shirt, but we're still going to reinforce it with duct tape, just prevents it from tearing. Um, so I'm going to go glue side up, slide the mask halfway over the tape, fold it over, and press down, trim off any excess duct tape that you got there. Watch your fingers. Uh, and then I'm going to do the same thing on the other side here as well. So again, rip off a piece of duct tape, glue side up, slide the mask over, drop it down, fold over the tape, press real hard, seam it, and trim off any excess. All right, now the next step is we're gonna test fit slash cut some ear holes. So what I do is I just hold up the mask um, with the flat side uh, over my nose and I kind of test fit where the center of my ear is. Um, after you do that, you're just gonna cut two slots and you're gonna slide them over your ears here. And that's how this is gonna kind of hang um, on your face. Next, we're going to mark where our embouchure would lay. So we're going to pretty much find the center of our embouchure when we play, and we're going to pinch right there and then take the mask off. Now, we're only going to cut a slice in one of the two pieces of fabric. So we're going to separate the mask in half, and I'm just going to take my scissors, and I'm going to just cut a slot for my mouthpiece. And then this way, one of the layers has a cut in it, but the other one still has the full... Um, layer of cotton without any holes in it. So when you put this on, um, it will look like a normal mask, but we can actually test fit um, by lifting up the first layer and setting our embouchure uh, on our instrument through the slot in the second layer here. So make sure everything fits, make sure that it's you got enough room, and I kind of just tuck the mask down around the mouthpiece here and once you're comfortable and ready, the only thing left to do is to play. And then if you have a question in class, you can just pull the cover down here and everything's all sealed up and your nose is covered, your mouth is covered, and you should be good to go.